is the winner. I'm announcing it right now because I know what is up you guys it's Julia and welcome back to my channel it has been so long since I filmed a YouTube video I apologize I was in Florida for like three weeks and I got a little bit of footage there but not enough to make a whole video so I might combine some of that footage with some footage I got the other day from surfing so there's gonna be another little vlog coming but today we are going to taste test every single GT's kombucha flavor, and we're gonna rate which one's our favorite. Now, I've tried just about most, uh, actually not really. I've tried maybe like half of the flavors. There's some flavors where I've never tried because they kind of like scare me, so I'm like, usually stay away from those. But today we're gonna try them all, and we're gonna rate them all, and I couldn't be more excited for a video. So stay tuned, I hope you love this video. Like, subscribe, and comment your favorite kombucha flavor, because I wanna know. You'll find out mine at the end of this video, but thank you so much for clicking on this video and I'm so excited to film and let's just Okay guys, I just went in the market and I got my kombuchas. It came to $40 and I think I got like 15 different ones. I think the way I'm gonna film this video is I think I'm going to try like one or two kombuchas every day for a couple days because if I open them all today, they're all gonna go bad really fast because when you open kombucha, it kind of like, it's like a soda, it um, loses its like carbonation fizziness. So I don't know if I'm gonna open them all today because I don't want them to all go bad because I'm actually gonna drink them. But I'll keep you updated. I'm not gonna try any yet. I wanna get them all together. So I'm gonna go to another store and then try them. So. I'll do that in a couple hours because I'm going to the gym now, but for you, it'll be in 10 seconds. So I'll see you again right now to taste them. Hello, you guys. It is way later in the day now. I just got home from the beach. And so we're going to taste test three flavors right now that I already had opened in my fridge. So I already know what these flavors taste like, but I'm gonna taste them on camera to give you guys my real reaction. Our Mystic Mango, Strawberry Lemonade, and Trilogy. First we're gonna do a Trilogy. I'm gonna swirl it up a little bit. These have been in the fridge for a couple days, opened, so they're gonna be a little flat, but the flavor will still be there. Okay. Trilogy. Trilogy is always so good. Always so good. This flavor, I honestly don't know how to describe it, but it's like, it's like no other flavor. That's how I'll put it. It's so good. It's like soury. It's very acidic-y. Like vinegary. But Trilogy just never disappoints. Okay, so that's Trilogy. Next, we're gonna do the strawberry lemonade. Now, let's get the taste test. Let me just tell you guys, this tastes exactly like a strawberry lemonade. Like it doesn't really have that acidic -y taste that kombucha usually has. So if you're scared to try kombucha because of that taste, or if you've tried kombucha and didn't like it because of that like acidic -y taste, get the strawberry lemonade GT's kombucha because it is so delicious. I think this one honestly might be my number one favorite. It's very early on in the video to say that, but as of right now, this one's the running, the running head. Okay, next we have Mystic. Mango. Oh, also I forgot each bottle has its own quote on it, so we'll go back and we'll read all the quotes. But let's taste the mango. This one's been in the fridge for a while, so I'm kind of scared, but. This one tastes like mangoes. It's not my favorite personally, just because the flavor of mangoes isn't my favorite, but it's yummy. If you like mangoes, you will love this one. So the quote on this bottle says, find what makes your soul happy, whatever it is, it's worth your time. Good morning, my friends. This morning, we are trying the tantric turmeric flavor of GT's kombucha. It's kind of nervous, but excited. The quote on this bottle is, the moon is always full, it just needs the light of the sun to realize. And that is so sweet. Anyways, I realized that yesterday when I was tasting them, I didn't rate them on a scale of 1 to 10. So we're just going to start by doing that with this one. So it might explode because I did accidentally shake it a little bit. You're not supposed to shake these because they'll explode if you do. See, look at it foaming. 
Okay, anyways. Oh, also I just brushed my teeth. That might not taste the best. That might interfere with the, oh well. Okay, it smells like turmeric. <clears throat> it's definitely gonna taste like turmeric. I'm scared, because it's not my favorite taste. Okay, I actually like it. They did a really good job of not overdoing it with the turmeric flavor, because sometimes turmeric can be like spicy, and this doesn't really have that, like maybe a little bit in your throat, but it's good. I don't know if I'd be able to drink the whole thing, but I could definitely drink like a good amount without getting like sick of the flavor. So I would rate this one probably a uh, five out of 10, just because turmeric's not my favorite flavor, but GT's killed it as always with the flavor so i'll see you guys probably later to take to taste another one hi look wow what is up you guys it's a couple hours later now and now i'm with nicole we're going thrifting but it's time to test our new flavor i've already had this one so i know what it tastes like but this flavor is so delicious but we're gonna do an on camera taste test Ooh. the quote on this one is being organic is not just what you eat but how you live i love that one I already know that this one's so good, but we have to do the test. This one tastes like orange juice, but sweeter, like a creamsicle popsicle. This one is so yummy. California citrus, I rate this one a nine out of 10. We're going high on this one. Pretty high rating. Okay, we're going thrifting, and I'll see you when it's time to test a new kombucha flavor. Hello my friends, it is the next day and today's a rainy day out and I really just want to get this video done So I have my whole big bag of kombuchas here. It's in an Elmo bag. I don't know why that's just the bag that I grabbed Anyways, we're just gonna try them all. I probably have about 10 or 15 in this bag and I wasn't gonna try them all because I don't want them to go bad But I'll just give them to like friends and stuff. So we're just gonna go for it. We're gonna try them all and we are going to rate them. Right now, I think in the lead is the strawberry lemonade. That's my number one favorite. So we're just gonna get straight into it. Starting with Pink Lady Apple. The quote on this one is, forgiveness in action is love washing over the heart. That is beautiful. Okay, let's taste this one. I'm kind of scared for, I'm kind of scared for this. It smells like apple juice. Oh, if this tastes like apple juice, that's gonna be so good. I love apple juice. It tastes like fresh pressed apple cider, but without like that cinnamon taste from a farm. Wow, I really like this one. Okay, this one I'm gonna rate. A 7 out of 10 because not my favorite but it is really delicious okay next we have golden pineapple I already know I like this one but let's taste it the quote on this one is step out of the darkness of yesterday and into the light of today whoa okay this one tastes like pineapple juice So good. This one is definitely an 8 out of 10. Can't go all the way up to 10 because the flavor of the pineapple could be a little stronger. Like if they added a little more pineapple flavor, it would make it way better because the flavor of the pineapple is kind of faint, but it is delicious. Okay, next we have ginger berry. I'm scared for this one because I don't like the taste of ginger and I have another one in there that's like just ginger. So I'm extra scared for that one. But this one's ginger berry, so hopefully it'll be okay. Quote on, this one is, when we speak to someone, they hear. When we speak with them, they listen. I love that. And that is so true. Okay, here we go. Ginger berry. GT's Kombucha, please sponsor me. Like, if I don't get sponsored after this video. Oh, 
Wow, they nailed this one. This reminds me of the um, very, very refresher from Starbucks, except like kombucha version. That's the only way I can describe this. But it does taste like a ginger berry. This one, I'm going to give a six out of 10 because I'm not a huge fan of the flavor of ginger, but they did an amazing job with this flavor and they nailed it. So, quite delicious. Okay, the next one that I just pulled out of the bag is the gingerade. So, I'm definitely the most scared for this one. I don't know if you guys can see. Oh, there's a card driving by, that's awkward. I don't know if you guys can see, but look at all the, the live bacteria in this one. This one's really cruising with that. Oh, what's the quote? Okay. Be as kind as to include, as brave as to inquire, and confident to know that you will in time be the one who will inspire. That's my new favorite quote. That just made me like tear up. This quote is going in my Instagram bio right now. I love that. Okay, this flavor better be good because I love that quote. Okay, let's taste. Oh, I can like feel the acidity. Ac I don't even know what word to use. The acidity in my chest. I need to breathe. Okay, here we go. Gingerade. Okay. If I liked the taste of ginger, I would like this. But I don't like the taste of ginger, so I don't know if I could drink it. The flavor of the ginger isn't that strong, but it's strong enough where like you can tell that it's like ginger flavored. What's the ingredients in this one? GT's kombucha, black tea, green tea, kiwi juice, and ginger juice. So this one's really just ginger juice. And it definitely tastes like ginger juice. This one, I'm gonna get, I feel so bad rating them like five and under because they're, none of them are bad. Like it's just flavor, I just spit everywhere. It's just flavor preference. And this is not my flavor preference, but like all the other ones, and I'm gonna say this 10 more times probably in the whole video, they nailed it. So, oh my goodness, what word did I just say? So flavor preference for me personally, I would rate this a five out of 10. It'd probably be one of the last ones I would choose to buy. But if this was the only one in the store, I would still buy it because it's still good. Okay, what do we have next? There's still so many in here, like at least 10. Okay, next we have Guava Goddess. I think I've had this one before, like a long time ago, but I don't remember what it tastes like, but I love guava juice, so I'm super excited. The quote on this one is, your knowing is your being. And that is so good too. They have the best quotes on their bottles. Like that's one of the main reasons why I love this brand is for their words of enlightenment. Okay, guava goddess, let's go. Yeah, this one's delicious. Tastes just like guava juice, except with that little extra hint of like spice. Not spice, but like the kombucha taste. So good. Okay, this one I will rate an eight out of 10 because it's delicious, but wouldn't be my first choice. But if you love guava juice, you will like this one. Okay, look at the setup we've got going on right now. Like, I keep putting them all right here, and eventually they're not going to fit anymore. But we're just going with it. Also, I think that's crooked, but... And the reason we're filming this in my car is because the lighting is just the best. And I'm in the Target parking lot. But, oh, here we go, my friends. Here we go. We're just going to swirl it up a little. This one has all the... Okay, this is Sacred Life. This was like their limited edition bottle because I'm pretty sure this was gonna be like a limited edition flavor, but then they ended up making it a permanent flavor. So this one is now a permanent flavor, thank God, because this one might be my number one. This one might triumph strawberry lemonade, if that was the right word to me. You know what this one tastes like and I already know I love it and I already know this one's a 10 out of 10, but we're gonna take a sip on camera because 
go. Oh my goodness. This one is 10 out of 10. My absolute number one favorite. Sacred Life. Sacred Life is the winner. I'm announcing it right now because I know that nothing is gonna make me love it more. Strawberry Serenity. The quote on this one, let go of your thoughts, follow your breath. This one's probably one of the ones that has like the least acidic kombucha taste. So if you're not a big fan of that, I would definitely go for the Strawberry Serenity. I am going to rate this one a seven out of 10 because again, I love it, it's yummy, but wouldn't be the first one I would choose on the shelf, but it's delicious. Okay, we have six left, five or six left. Lemon Berry. I tried this one for the first time a couple weeks ago, and it's... Okay guys, my camera ran out of storage, but we're back. Okay, we were at Lemon Berry, so let's... Let's taste the lemon berry. This one's delicious. It like tastes like the perfect combination of the berry and the lemon that it tastes like a berry lemonade. And so this one tastes more like a lemonade too, like the other strawberry lemonade one I had. I think I'm gonna rate this one a nine out of 10. Like, faced with the choice of which one to choose, there's a very good chance I would probably choose to buy this one off of the shelf. Oh! <gasps> there it is. Fine. Okay, what is next? Cosmic Cranberry. Look not outside yourself, for all can be found within. I love that. They never cease to amaze me with their, with their quotes. Okay, let's get to it. Hoping that this tastes like cranberry juice. I think I had this one once, but like years ago, like two years ago, so I don't really remember what it tastes like. Oh, I'm like short of breath from drinking all these. Okay. It does taste like cranberry juice. Wow. This one's good. It's like extra sour though. So if you like sour things, and if you like cranberry juice, then this probably is the flavor for you. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna rate this one a seven out of 10. Next, we have the multi green. The quote on this one, I love this. I am what I eat, therefore I am a positive microbe. Excellent. Okay, it smells really bad. Not gonna lie. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, I'm so scared. Okay, here we go. Okay, it tastes like chickpeas. That's really strange. It doesn't taste like how you would expect a green drink to taste like it literally takes tastes like baked chickpeas okay I'm gonna rate this one a 6 out of 10 I don't think I could drink it because it reminds me of chickpeas and like I'm drinking something that's green and I'm not eating chickpeas but this one is freaking amazing for your health so that would probably be the reason why I would choose to buy it and drink it so 6 out of 10 for this one the flavor it doesn't taste bad it's just like it's odd so that's the multi-green. Okay, next we have the <laughs> Spring Edition Synergy. This is the bloom flavor. I have had this one before. Alex and I tried this one once. He did not like it, but I remember, I didn't think it was that bad. So let's taste it again, get a fresh memory. This one literally just like, it tastes like flowers. Like I feel like if I ate a flower, like it would taste like this. And it kind of makes sense because the flavor of this is elderflower, jasmine, violet. 
So it's like literally just flowers, but pretty good. What's the ingredients in this one? The ingredients are GT's kombucha, elderflower, jasmine, violet. Oh, that's it. And then there's a little like note on this that says in full bloom. Our kombucha is nature's beauty transformed. Every drop is a unique expression of life and reminds us that each moment offers an opportunity for growth. When we embrace our inner beauty, we nurture our mind, body, and soul. May you spread your wings and allow your true, authentic self to soar. Peace and love, GT Dave. Beautifully written. Okay. Last but not least, we have the original. Yay. Okay, I have no idea what this is going to taste like. Like, absolutely no clue what to expect for this one. Am I nervous? Yes. I've never had this one. So the quote on this one is, inhale, exhale, the breath that sustains you is proof enough that you are meant for great things. You are divine. I love that. The only ingredients in this is just GT's kombucha, which is kombucha culture, black tea, green tea, and kiwi juice. And 100% pure love. You can't forget that. Oh, it doesn't smell good. And there's a lot of stuff floating in this one. Oh, oh, okay. <sighs> I'm scared. Okay, it's not that bad. It's just plain. I'm more of a flavor girl. I don't know if I'd buy this one and drink it. Mm -mm. This one's not for me. I'm going to rate this one a 3 out of 10 because it's not for me. But if you're a big kombucha drinker, you probably get this one and like it. That is going to be it for this video. Here is all the kombuchas that I just tried. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you go and buy these kombuchas and try them because seriously, I drink one every day. They are amazing and... I love them, and GT's Kombucha, please sponsor me, or just send me kombucha at least, like please. Um, I love the kombucha. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, share with all your friends, and I will see you guys in my next video.